There is so much writing on the wall at this point, it's like the Bible. Writing on the wall, it's graffiti. <laughs> it is it's totally entire, graffiti. Uh, when it comes to, we're talking about uh, Ben Affleck and Jennifer Lopez over, and their marriage. Over and out. Uh, the latest scribbling on the wall uh, is Ben's new house. Yeah. Yes. We broke uh, this over the weekend so on Saturday. You knew that he had been living in a rental. Well, this is where he makes it permanent. This is the new home that he has purchased in Brentwood. <laughs> in and Brentwood. And it's beautiful. It's a, it's a $20.5 million. So he's there uh, to stay. And if you needed more proof this marriage is over, I don't care if you see wedding rings on them from time to time. Right. He bought a house. They're selling the marital house. And, and she's, she's looking, looking for her house. own house. Right. So how is their reconciliation in that scenario? It does not, <laughs> there's not really any view of it that there could be. And we haven't seen them together for so long. JLo's been in the Hamptons. She celebrated her birthday out there, which he did not post about. Even their two year wedding anniversary kind of came and went. They, neither of them posted about that either. Ben's been here in LA. Obviously, he just got like a new house. By the way, in the same area that his uh, former wife, Jennifer Garner, lives. Um, so it's like interesting he's moving closer to her, but like farther away from JLo. And it's really confusing because JLo and Ben continue to wear their wedding rings. So it doesn't make sense at all to people that really know what's going on, which is this marriage is, is not working out right now. And it's over. It's, it's over. Yeah, yeah, they're living apart. It's over.